Hello, I'm Magic Al. Welcome to Tasting Beer with Magic Al with our next beer in this six pack. Saga Tuck's Blueberry Maple Stout. I am nervous about this beer. I am excited about this beer. It's something that's outside of my comfort zone that's kind of exciting, but I'm nervous. Fruit beers are not my thing. Um, but I've brewed cherry stouts before and they've been fine. Just tone down the fruit in it and you're okay. But this has got a picture of a lumberjack eating a stack of blueberry pancakes with syrup everywhere. Look at that. Crazy. Um, I like good whiskeys and bourbons. And a couple years ago, there was the craze of maple bourbons. And they were horrible. You know, just give me maple syrup and it'll be better. And then I start hearing about maple in beers. And there was one I liked. It was the CBS. And there was very little maple in it. Um, just a hint. And that was okay. If this is just a hint, great. If not, we'll see what we get. Anyway, Soccer Talk Brewing Company is out of Douglas, uh, Wisconsin. They are on the border of Lake Michigan. Um, it looks like a nice place to go visit. I will give them a try. I don't know anything about the brewery. I didn't really read up a lot on this beer because I didn't want to be influenced by any write-ups and stuff. All I want to know going into the can is what it says on the can. So let's see what this says on the can. Here's to happy. A rich sweet stout with a classic malt characteristics. Okay. So, sweet stout, um, I like milk stouts. Those are sweet stouts, good stuff. Love classic malts, especially in a stout, the roastiness, so far we're good. Uh, where was a classic malt characteristic with a bold, unique twist? Now I'm starting to get scared. This beer tastes like you crammed a fat stack of blueberry pancakes into a pint glass and smothered it with maple syrup. This is what I did not want. But we'll give it a try since I'm trying beers with you for both of our benefit. All right. It says channel your inner lumberjack because it is in for a real treat. Oh boy. Wish us luck. Let's open it up. and see. It looks like any stout. Um, it looks like a dark brown. It is not totally opaque. It's got a nice brown head to it, lightly foam. Uh, it's dissipating a little bit. <laughs> it smells like blueberries. Holy cow. And I taste some roasted malts. So the aroma is pretty much what the can is. I smell no maple though. Blueberry and roasted coffee, some roasted caramels in the uh, malts. All right, moment of truth time. Let's taste this beer. Cheers. There's a lot going on with this beer. I like it. I'll say that straightforward. Um, it is not, wow, it is blueberry. I was gonna say it's not as sweet as the can made it sound like, but it is sweet. 
um, but not sweet like a milk stout. It's like blueberry extract is in here as well. Um, and I'm not getting the maple syrup. Okay, I'm getting very little bit of maple syrup. This is a really good stout. Um, it's kind of thin or light. It's not a thick stout by any means. Um, I think if you would have added a lot of oatmeal or flaked oats to this, it would have smoothed it out some. It's trying to be a little on the crisp side. It's, it's interesting. Eh, I'll give it maybe two and a half to two and three quarter stars on untapped. There's my information. Give it a check. I'll finish it, and if things change drastically as this warms up, I will revisit, and you'll see me back in just a moment. If not, Cheers.